Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. If you are a return subscriber, hey, if you are a new subscriber, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you can be notified whenever I post and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any videos. Today I'm going to teach you guys how to bleach your frontals. Um, this is a 613 frontal. A 613 frontal is blind. I like to start off applying my product to the hairline first because I just like to make sure like those knots are really bleached right at the tip of my hairline. Um, when you're making your bleach, you want to make sure it's a thick consistency. You want it to be thick like toothpaste. It should not be thin um, or runny because if it is, it'll bleed through the lace and it'll get onto your roots and it'll give you like hot roots and it just won't be pretty. So just make it thick to where it's thick like toothpaste because I feel like this is most important because that's what's really showing. I you don't really have to start off the roots. I just like to do that because I like to make sure, you know, that bleach is first. But please excuse my background. I was in the middle of working and it was on a computer. And I just didn't realize that it looked so bad like it does in the video. And I wish I could have fixed it, but I couldn't crop it out. <laughs> Sorry. Just make sure that you are not applying any pressure when you are putting the bleach into your frontal. Because honestly, y'all, any amount of pressure will leak. Um, this product through your lace and you don't want to have to go through that because you're gonna have to fix it It is fixable, but I have to do more work when you don't have to you know Also, I never use a spoon unless I'm out of popsicle sticks um, I normally always use popsicle sticks to do this because it's easier and it spreads so fast Like you guys see how I have to keep trying to go back to filling those holes um, If I had a popsicle stick, I wouldn't have to do that because it was smear on so easy But if you do use a spoon, just make sure it's a plastic spoon Do not use metal um, when you're dealing with chemicals ever 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 If you don't know how to mix the products, you just mix the um, powdered bleach into the liquid. And you just will need to make sure it's thick enough like toothpaste. And this is how my knots look before I bleached them. This is a blonde wig. It was just colored ginger by my client. And then this is after I bleached the knots. You guys can see those knots are completely gone. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you guys learned. Give me feedback. And make sure you go watch another video. Hit the thumbs up and subscribe.